The Whipple operation, um, and by the way, the other name for that operation is pancreatic odudinectomy, is an operation that is about five hours long. Um, the operation can be done either with open surgery or laparoscopically through the smaller incisions. The choice of uh, the approach uh, depends on the patient and, and the tumor characteristics. Um, the uh, operation itself involves removing the head of the pancreas, the duodenum, the gallbladder, and the end of the bile duct. In some of these operations, we also take a small portion of the stomach. Uh, sometimes we do this, sometimes we don't. Obviously, after removing uh, these uh, uh, pieces, we have to reconstruct the patient, and there are three main reconnections. You have to reconnect the pancreas uh, back to the intestines, the bile duct back to the intestines, and the stomach back to the intestines. Uh, typically, these patients will then, after this operation, spend the first night in the intensive care unit, and most patients will then go to a regular floor bed uh, and spend uh, about a week uh, or so after the operation. Some patients actually are discharged from the hospital sooner than that, others take a little bit longer. I tell most of my patients that it'll take them about a month after surgery before they tell me I feel pretty good, and about two months before most of them say I'm pretty much recovered from the operation.